some time to remember who you are and who has done it before. But the other key with his Ochens is that he's most of his life. And he said yesterday at the weigh-ins that he is finally 100% healthy. And he lacked in shape. Pedro Hizzo enters into the M1 Global Ring with a night. That's the rock, man. Fedor Emelianenko. The beloved icon here. And everybody knew it. They wasn't just a number one. You know, they forget, man, this is somebody you once called G-O-D inside. He was released from Strike Force after those three losses. Back here, an M1 retirement before uh, after he, he lost to Bigfoot Silva if it's God's will he will retire his brother Alexander in the audience to watch the last emperor walking to the M1 ring possibly for the last time he has had for 37 it's intimidating man like you just can't get him out of his can't get him out of his game you know stone stare from a man who when he's outside of the ring has a smile like a young child and the russian fans acknowledge Fedor's entrance into the M1 Global Ring. Zero. Considered by me, comes out in the short black and delivers a kick to the ribs of Hizzo. Pedro's eyes, I mean, direct. Jab lands, follows it with the hook. These, you're exactly right, Jeff. The more he, I mean, it's, this is impressive. Well, Hizzo has some hit now. Yeah, you know, the age bit. Too much thinking. You're waiting for that perfect shot. And big right. Thunderous knockout. As Fedor Emelianenko. 
Rocco knocks out Pedro. That was that was some impressive that was some impressive power. That was he was staring directly at you, Pedro. I love you to death, son. You know what a shot, what a fight. I never seen something so tense. I mean, you could you think a little too much. An embrace and kiss from his wife and daughter. The 15 year anniversary show in November. I can tell you this, they're gonna win. And let's make it official. Ladies and gentlemen, He said, thank God we won. This is our victory. An embrace from the Russian president. The family together.